Okay. Hi everybody, it's Lindsay, and I thought I would show you what, just to see if Mod Podge, I don't know if you can see that, because I can't see, there we go, Mod Podge works with napkins. So, let's do this. You always want, I'm outside, so I might not be able to still do this, but we'll see. You always want to make sure you have something on, or under, sorry, under your page that you're doing. So it doesn't go onto the other page. And I'm using these napkins. I don't remember where I got these, but in there it says creative convert converting. Okay. <laughs> So, let's try this. It's a little windy, so I'm going to be really, really careful. And normally I wouldn't do it this way, but I'm just testing it out. There we go. And I'll put some on the page. Just so I can get this down. There we go. And that was not enough. <laughs> See? Trial and error. There. It's gonna dry quick. So, we're gonna put some down on the page. Like that. There we go. And I wanted to make this video. You might never see this video, but I wanted to try and make it. There. And as you can see, it is windy. But... I am doing it very unconventional, as you can see, but I thought I'd give it a go. There we go. Now I'm going to end up cutting it. Just do one drop. And my page is not... Yeah, we'll see if this works. And I'm actually not even going to do on the top. I'm just going to do under. I think I will end up getting the gesso. Just because then it will. And that's my compressor. You might not be able to hear me now, but we'll see. When I watch this video. There we go. And yeah, this is gonna have bubbles. So I might not even show this to anybody. Trial and error, right? And we are gonna put a little bit on. Because I haven't... 